Hello, grade two. Let's, it's, uh, it's, today is Wednesday. And let's sing, it's a great things to praise the Lord. Before we start our math, it's a great thing. Ready? Walk, walk, walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walking in the light of God. It's a great thing to praise the Lord. It's a great thing to praise the Lord. It's a great thing to praise the Lord. Walking in the light of God. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walking in the light of God. It's a great thing to know the Lord. It's a great thing to know the Lord. It's a great thing to know the Lord. Walking in the light of God. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walking in the light of God. It's a great thing to serve the Lord. It's a great thing to serve the Lord. It's a great thing to serve the Lord. Walking in the light of God. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walking in the light of God. It's a great thing to love the Lord. It's a great thing to love the Lord. It's a great thing to love the Lord. Walking in the light of God. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walk, 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 walk in the light. Walking in the light of God. Okay, let's praise dear Jesus. Thank you for this day. Please help us and guide us in everything that we're going to do for today. And please cleanse us from all our unrighteousness. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The topic for our math today is problem solving problem solving so problem number one bianca has a collection of barbie stickers she already had five fifty-five barbie stickers in her scrapbook her cousin gave her 23 stickers more how many stickers does bianca have in all so this is our problem. So for us to solve this problem, we need to follow steps, okay? Step number one, understand the problem. What is ask, okay? So what is ask is how many stickers does Bianca have in all? So most of the time you can see it sa the the last the one it ends with a question okay and it's on the last sentence of your problem and then what are given so given are the numbers okay that you can find in the problem so we have 55 barbie stickers and 23 stickers more okay so 55 barbie stickers and 23 stickers more so that is step number one understand the problem what is asked and what are given or what are the given numbers okay step number two you need to plan how are you gonna plan how will you solve the problem decide what process to use so for this one we're gonna add the process that we're gonna use is addition or add we're gonna add it so because we get um 
we are studying addition that's why it's easy to know that the solution or the process that we're going to use is add but the clue there for you to know that um it is addition is you it's here it's more more okay if it is more addition left subtraction okay or also this one have in all okay so that one is addiction and then for subtraction how many left okay man those are the questions for subtraction and we're gonna learn that maybe um two weeks from now or three weeks from now okay oh after this we'll do our uh, subtraction already after problem solving then we'll proceed to our subtraction and then we'll have our problem solving in involving subtraction in our subtraction lesson so now so we let's go back let's do it again step number one understand the problem what is asked and what are given step number two you need to plan what are you what process you're gonna use and it says here we're gonna add and step number three we're gonna solve the problem so write the addition sentence you can write it like this but if it is like this you need to solve it in a separate paper because sometimes numbers has um what's that um carry right the remain you carry so you need to but if if uh, you need to do it like this okay but if it is easy number five plus three it's okay like this or if it is like this you can solve it in your whiteboard and then write it in your notebook okay like this so so we have here 55 plus 23 equals 73 so here 55 55 plus 23 equals 78 okay 5 plus 3 equals 8 and then 5 plus 2 equals 7 so that is step number three now let's go to step number four and the step number four is to look back if we answered it if we're up it means we need to check our answer if it is correct okay so let's do it again step number one understand the problem what is asked what are given step number two you need to plan what solution are you gonna use step number three solve it and step number four check your answer okay pa? now please let's have our let's try okay this one i will uh, this one doesn't have point so let's just try and then if you are wrong you can copy my answer so please get your book let's try page 103 number one open it on page 103 number one ready five four three two one ready so let's read the story of uh, the problem Beya needs 26 starfish stickers and 29 shell stickers to make a design for her art project how many stickers does she need in all okay so what is ask so what is ask here ready try to answer on your own ready go what is ask remember usually it ends with a question mark and you can find it in the last the last sentence of the problem okay let's go to number next we and we are understanding the problem right step one so what are given what are given what are given numbers next number three how would you solve the problem are we gonna add it subtract multiply or divide okay so we are going to write your answer and then solve it now write the number sentence here and solve it okay you can do like this yung 
pa straight line or pa down down okay write the number sentence then writing the number sentence now let's look back okay is is your answer correct okay so now i'm going to show you and compare my your answer to teacher bell's answer and then if your answer is wrong please change it okay for this one only for this because it's still let's try so when you review it ah this is the correct answer okay so let's do, have let's check what is asked how the answer is how many stickers does she need in all who got the correct answer okay so now if you got the wrong you can erase it and then change it into and change it and then copy this one next what are given so what are given always remember it is the numbers so what are the numbers there 26 starfish stickers and 29 shell stickers who got the correct answer here raise your hand very good but if you are wrong please copy next how would you solve the problem it is we're gonna add correct so write the number sentence and your answer 26 plus 29 equals 55 i will repeat 26 plus 29 equals 55 who got the correct answer very good now let's look back does the sum show how many in all it is yes is your answer correct yes okay so for our for our next activity you don't need to write this one and write this one you will just write the number sentence but remember we need to what understand the problem plan solve and look back so please open your book on page 105 105 okay before you write let me read the problem first moses has 50 pesos father gave him another 20 pesos more how much money does moses have in all so what is ask ready say it correct how much money does moses have in all next question what are given think say it correct 50 pesos and 20 pesos okay and now you need to what problem what process or what solution are we gonna use it's addition correct so please add that one 50 pesos plus 20 pesos then the answer will you will write it here ready go okay so next number two if you are not yet done you can pause the video then answer okay pa uncle john number two uncle john gave me 58 blue toy cars grandfather gave me 27 red toy cars how many toy cars do i have in all so what is asked ready think please say it correct what is asked is how many toy cars do i have in all next what are given ready think please say it correct 58 blue toy cars and 27 red toy cars now what solution are we gonna use yes addition or we're gonna add it so write this number sentence here and write your answer here ready go
Next, let's go to number three. Number three. Angel bought 96 red roses and 112 white roses. How many roses are there in all? Okay, what is ask? Ready? Think. Please say it. Correct. The answer is how many roses are there in all? What are given? Think. Say it. Correct. 96 red roses and 112 white roses. What solution are we going to use? Okay, right. We're going to add. So please write 96 plus 112, okay? And then your answer here. Go. Now let's go to the last number. There are 10 cars and 18 vans in the parking lot. How many vehicles are in the parking lot? Ready? What is ask? Think. Say it. Correct. How many vehicles are in the parking lot? And then what are given? Say it. Correct. 10 cars and 18 vans. Next, what solution? Okay, or what process are we going to use? Correct, we need to add. So please write here 10 plus 18 equals and then your answer. Okay, so now we are done and I want you to, for your assignment, study for our quiz tomorrow and take a picture of page 105 and send it in our class dojo. Thank you everyone and see you tomorrow. Bye!